We are continuing the meditation with the beautiful smile in our face. <laughs> oneness, oneness, oneness. Very good, very good, very good. <laughs> Ananda, Ananda, blissfulness. Ananda, bliss. <laughs> very good. Very good. Very good. <laughs> <laughs> With the regular meditation, we get a lot of bliss. <laughs> the moment we sit in meditation, a lot of energy rushes towards us from all the directions. We receive energies. Receive, receive, receive. <laughs> Five, four, three. <laughs> Two, one, one less, one less, one less. We are happily continuing the meditation. Connected to the whole, whole unity, whole God, whole, whole energy. We are that energy. We are the one with the whole. We are all one, connecting with the group energies. Oneness. Meditation procedure. I repeat. Clasping our hands and keeping our hands in a comfortable in our lap comfortably. Sitting in a cross legs posture. Cross your legs. Close your eyes. Now, stable and comfortable posture. Next thing is, next three things are important. Relax body, smile in your face, observing the breath. So once again, I repeat once again. Clasp hands and keep them in your lap. Cross your legs, close your eyes. Stable and comfortable posture. Relax body, body, with a smile, observing the breath. This is the meditation procedure. Let us relax our body. Make sure your forehead is relaxed, eyes are relaxed, nose, ears are relaxed and relaxed and relaxed. Throat neck are relaxed, shoulders, hands are relaxed, chest, stomach, abdomen. 
or relaxed and relaxed and relaxed. Upper back, middle back, lower back are relaxed. Thighs, knees, top muscles, feet are relaxed and relaxed and relaxed. Relax our physical body. All the muscles are relaxed. Make sure that hands and legs muscles are relaxed. Stomach is relaxed. Eyes are relaxed. From top to bottom, make one scan, one time scan and relax every part of the body. Relax and relax and relax. <laughs> As in when you are relaxing, you are receiving more and more energies and more and more happiness also you might experience. So relax your body, relax, relax. With the count of 10 to 0, we relax our body to the deepest levels. And 9, 8, 1, so, deep relaxation. Feel I'm connected to the my words. Feel the feel my words. Thousands of times relaxation. Lots of times relaxation. Feel them inside your body. Feel them. Course of times relax in your body, relax. So relaxation is happening in our, to our body. Mm, Final relaxation, complete, complete relaxation. Mm. Five, four, three. Let us use all of our energies and all of energy and all of our powers to go into deeper states of relaxation, much more relaxation. For example, in the Olympics, running race competition, to get a gold medal. One uses the, his total, his or her total energies and full inner, inner powers, everything they use, use everything. They wanted to get the gold medal. In the same way, in the meditation, also we, let us use all of our determination power, will power, all the concentration, every, whatever the powers are there, whatever the energies are there, everything, we utilize it to the relaxing our physical body. Can we relax much more than this? Can we relax much more? Check that. Relax every body part, every cell, every cell, every atom in your body. Relax and relax and relax. Relax. 
There is no complete, the body is completely relaxed in such a way that in our deep sleep, how much we deeply we relax, the same way we are sitting and relaxing, the body is relaxed, that much relaxation. When we do the Shavasana, how much relaxation happens? It's like a dead body, that much relaxation. Heart beat also relaxed, balanced. Breath is also slow, relaxed breath. Slow and short breath. Relaxed breath, cool breath. So, Now there is no need to work for any further relaxation. Work is zero, work becoming zero. Because the body is already relaxed. Body work is done. Mind, to make it calm, you keep it observing the breath. Body feeling like is it there or not? Relax. Sometimes when you feel you need a little bit more relaxation, you can observe and relax. Whole body relax, can relax. If your body is feeling like disappeared, is it there or not? Is my hands are there or not? Are my hands and legs are there or not? Or they disappear or dissolve into the whole universe. Dissolve. If you want, to also, you know, I don't want to move my hand. I'm not feeling, you know, the hand is stable only, it's good. You're not feeling like you're moving your hand also. That's, that means that your body is already in a relaxed state, deep, relaxed state. It's very good. Your body might be feeling lighter. Light. That's very good. Disappeared. That's amazing. Body relaxed. Complete relaxed. Hundred percent relaxed. Relaxed and relaxed. Mind. Observing the breath. Bodily state is there. Mind also calm. What else is there? Our original nature, but the blissfulness is there. This is our original nature. It is kind of a little bit happiness, a feeling factor might be happening. That's all wonderful. Last two minutes. That's all the body is relaxed. Mind is observing the breath. Um, and relax breathing. So breathing is happening. Heart beat also relaxed and balanced. Instead of happening every every minute, the seventy two beats per minute. Now it's slow and low. Slow breathing, slow beating. Slower and slower. Resting heart rate is lesser than the normal heart rate. It's okay. 
meditation heart beat is very very less deeper and deeper meditations oxygen consumption also reduces by 80 or up to 80 or less dogs it's very good this is called metabolic rate and down that's very good in meditation deeper meditation samadhi relaxation relaxation ha last one minute now the body is completely relaxed mind is observing the breath, with breath then we feel happiness and this because that is our original nature relax body all the body parts are relaxed relax and relax and relax smile on the face and in our being smile sometimes the smile might not happen in your face but inside your being in the with every second you are relaxing and with every breath you are relaxing and Connecting to your inner nature, original nature that is the soulness. Observe the body, scan the body. Make it relax more, and also observe the energies and happiness. You might feel the vibrations of happiness or some changes, some positive. The feel good factor. The relaxed state, the shanth state. this one is anything last 30 seconds last turn on and right yes smile observe breathing right Three, two, one, zero. Place your hands on your eyes for five seconds. Five, four, three, two, one, zero. Laps and appreciate ourselves for our meditation. Good meditation. Very good. Very good. Very good. Wonderful. And say namaskar to our gurus. Thank you to all the gurus. Thank you. Namaskar, Mukta. Thank you.
Thank you. One less, one less, one less. Thank you, friends. Now you can rub, rub your hands and apply to your face or, or knees or any part of your body where you need more energies. You can apply. Very good. Thank you, friends. Thank you all. And welcome to the day second, day two of Train Your Mind. How many of you are already did ho your homework yesterday? Type H. And how is the meditation? You can type that. Very good. Miraculous meditation. Very good. Wonderful friends. So, and tomorrow also this meditation will be there. Hmm. From 7 to 8, so 7 to first to uh, 15 20 minutes of the every one hour, the same group, the same link, Zoom link will be having the meditation. First to 20, 15 or 20 minutes. Okay, tomorrow also it will be there. You can also join if you, if you like to join. 7 to 7 20, 7 15, 8 to 8 15, again 9 to 9 15. 7 o'clock, uh, the interview it will be there. 8 o'clock in Hindi, it will be there. 9 o'clock in English, it will be there. Okay. Very good, friends. So, how many of you did your homework? One minute homework I did. I asked how many of you did the type H. How many of you are already feeling that you're, you'll be having a thoughtless state? You'll be at the end of the five days, you'll be. Achieving thoughtless stage for at least 10 minutes. Confidence, if you are feeling the confidence, C type C, confidence. Very good. So wonderful. So, now today's topic is self-love. So everybody, let us all stretch a little bit. And also enjoy them. Every, Every stretching also, if you are if you're having energy, you will enjoy the stretching also. Ah, very good, feel good factor will be there. Stretching and do the stretching and see. Ah. Left side, right side, on this side. Turn back from this side. Ah. Very good. So, yeah, during meditation, visualization is there. The visualization is okay uh, for time being. Yeah, if you, you can master the visualizations also. I said advanced meditation, we conduct it in. We teach that also in the good uh, occasion, next level course, advanced course. This meditation is for thoughtless state, okay? uh, not having thoughts. Thoughts means? Definition of thought, how many, uh, anybody wants to type the definition of the thought which I gave yesterday? What is thought? So, anybody can type in the meantime, I will, will be talking. Today's topic is about self-love. Self-love. What is self-love? Love towards our body, our own mind, our self, and loving all of our surroundings and everybody in the in our life. Yeah, and also loving the universe, whole universe. This is called self-love. I'll talk about it in detail. So yeah, now I'm seeing the answers. What is thought means? When you, Tripti Goenka message, when you speak to yourself in some language, yes. When you, you're speaking to yourself in a language that has words and sentences, a complete sentence is called thought. Okay, talking with your mind. Okay, speaking in a language, talking with yourself, with the other, or with others in mind. Yeah, that's good. Okay, talking with ourselves or with others <laughs> in our mind. That's okay. Okay, so wonderful. Okay, that's a thought. So if it is a sentence, that is only thought. If it is a word, that's okay. You do not bother about it. Complete sentences is thought in a language. Okay. So visualizations are the advanced, those are advanced, advanced meditation. We you can stop visualization, images and visualizations, everything is okay. That's part of the meditation. Uh, but uh, it's part of the already advanced meditation. In the super advanced meditation, you stop that also. You can visualization coming, any flow is happening, flow of events are 
video and anything is happening means you're already into the advanced meditation. Okay, that's the uh, part of you're already receiving energies at the time. Okay, you're already relaxed already. The visions are happening. Okay, that's good. Advanced, you already entered into advanced meditation. But in the super advanced meditation, you can stop that balance. That training we will give in the next train, next Buddha Kesha. There are four levels, thoughtless stage. That's at least this class is about thoughtless stage. And next thing is deep thoughtless stage. There where you will feel good vibrations in the thoughtless stage and good vibrations in the body will be. Next thing is advanced meditation, advanced thoughtless stage. Here your body is bodyless state you already achieved and here you will feel you might have certain visions or images of a dreamy like asylum many things might be happening. This is called advanced advanced thoughtless stage. And this is called deeper thoughtless stage. Advanced meditation is called. Okay. In the meditation, deep meditation, advanced, deeper meditation, this is called deeper thoughtless stage. This is called, next thing is complete. You're not there, the whole universe is called, not there, complete disappear. That's called super advanced meditation. That's called deepest thoughtless state. Thoughtless stage, deep thoughtless stage, deeper thoughtless stage, deepest thoughtless stage. So in Buddha Kesha, we give all this training, these four things will happen. Thoughtless stage will be here, the training is there. The next training, deeper trainings will happen in Buddha Kesha. Naturally, that will happen. Without even telling that, that will not naturally happen. That's advanced course because that's the reason. Then, uh, then what happens is when you reach the super advanced meditation, the deepest thought distance, then the fifth level will unveil. That's called enlightenment, blissful state. Blissful and the ultimate blissful state. That's called gamma state. That is called super, con super consciousness state. So these first two things are called thoughtless stage and deep thoughtless stage is called connecting to the subconscious mind. Bridge, bridge, awareness is here. Awareness is also, this is called bridge. And uh, this is called deeper thoughtless stage is called connecting to subconscious mind. Deepest thoughtless stage is called connecting to unconscious mind. Unconscious, connecting to the collective, collective consciousness. And super advanced, this is the next one is super consciousness, right? Super consciousness is connecting to the whole universe, and you can affirm you can change the things also in the universe. The bliss, whoever has the bliss, the manifestation power uh, maximizes for those who have who has the bliss, those who are happy. Manifestation power will be at the highest for them. Whatever they think they want, it will be given from the universe. The universe gives so much happy. You must you are giving a lot of Bliss to the bliss to yourself means you're sharing the bliss to the whole universe. That means the universe is uh, universe feels a lot of tremendous connection with you immediately. Uh, tremendous because the universe is getting a lot of blissful vibrations from you. Whatever you ask uh, without asking, also you must take care of you. That's why remember your sadhana came to the next level. Universe responds. Universe supports. Universe automatically takes care of you at every point of time. And whatever your desires immediately manifests. So to reach that level, so first we'll work on the this uh, through many different ways we can work through through the meditation and also when you're not doing meditation the, on the closed eyes meditation, at the time you can do the, the love, you can practice the love. That's one technique. Okay, love is uh, let us practice the love with the med small meditation, two minutes meditation, two minutes meditation. Close your eyes. We are loving our body. Eyes, we are loving our eyes, face, neck, throat, shoulders. Love, love, love. Heart, we are loving our heart. Loving our chest, stomach. Love, love, love. Abdomen, love, love, love. love. Intestines, bones, blood circulation, muscles. Love, skin, love. Every part of our body, even hair and everything, skin pores, loving our, our whole body as it is, completely love, 100% love, 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 love. We are loving and accepting, not only accepting, we are loving ourselves, our nature, our character, our wisdom, our upbringing, upbringing our surroundings. We are loving everything. Next level is, we are loving all of our 
Actually, whoever comes in our life, they are eligible for our love. No, no, no. People, trees, animals, everything and everyone. Nimble kingdom, things, no, no, no. Or whomever we look, we look with the hundred percent love. Love, talk, it, talk. All every word is with the love. Love, no. Every touch in our life, we are always touching the mother earth by walking. The clouds are touching us. They are touching the clouds every time. Now. The chair we are sitting now. Most of the times we are touching the cell phone with the love, love, love. The moon, universe, whatever, who, whatever we are seeing, whatever we are hearing, everything with the love. Now going to the next level. That's called unknown universe. We are loving the unknown, the whole. We are loving the. People who are not in our life, whom we don't know also. We are loving the whole, the one with everything, everyone. As a Sarvatma consciousness, we are loving the whole universe and beyond. Universes are coming and going, but the love is permanent, eternal. That love we are connecting to, that love we are becoming. We are the one with the love, whole love, true love. That is a universal love, that is called oneness. Love is there in the past, present, and future. In all the dimensions, all the time, love is there. That love, we are connecting. That is called oneness. Hundred percent love with everything and everyone and in the time dimension, all the multiverse and everything, all the parallel worlds, purple worlds, and everything is called together. Is called oneness. 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 Five. Four. Three, two, one, zero. Place your hands on your eyes. Five, four, three, two, one, zero. Thanks to the meditation. Appreciate ourselves for the meditation. Very good, very good, very good. Now say to gurus, thank you, thank you, gurus, thank you. All the guru shakti, vishu shakti, thank you. Oneness, oneness, oneness. Rub your hands and place it on your eyes or face or any way, any part of your body you can touch or without touching also you can place a little bit distance also. Anything is okay. Very good friends. So, so this is about the law, friends. So, how many of you wanted to fill your life, whole life, with the law? You can type love life, LL. Type LL. Complete life with the law. Okay, wonderful. So, so friends, come up with the ways. How to, how to, it's like a, love is always great, we know that. But how many of you are already implementing it? So, just try and come, come up with the ways where we can implement and fill the love with the, in our whole life. If you think about it, probably one thing is maintaining a diary and talking about the love, teaching about the love to others. So it's not about the individual person love, it's about the whole universal love. Friends. Remember this? It's like a up and down, it's not up and down. The individual person love means sometimes you're happy, sometimes you're sad. The person is not there. I'm not talking about it. I'm talking about continuous and permanent and 24 hours love. That happens in the whole universe only. Oneness only. Okay? Remember. The way the law which I'm talking is eternal law, continuous law. Not like okay, somebody you love and that person is there, you're loving, and that person is not there. 
or when that person stop talking to you uh, feeling bad it's not the law that law, that is not at all law i'm not talking about that i'm talking about the true law which can stay till the poor house you are so friends now yeah those who wants to implement they can use one technique the technique is called diary writing if you can write a diary these three levels of law self law body and mind law and also the people and everything whatever you are saying loving everything and the loving the third level is unknown means loving unknown people loving the whole universe loving the whole oneness these three levels if you can maintain a diary and write it in the evening around 9 o'clock or 10 o'clock if you can maintain before uh, that is before night the evening just if you can write it how many hours i am in the cell loving frequency or how many how much time i am i lost into that if you can write it and make it 24 hours implement it practically that's where you pass the earth school you will get you will clear the earth school and go to the next level how many of you wanted to write the diary you can type b you know you wanted to really implement it i wanted to implement by writing a diary you can type d so very good sandeep uh, the first right very good sandeep is very active it seems okay next sri lanka jabo hari hari was a third god of very good very good friends okay so daily writing and also teaching whatever you wanted to grow a lot teaching is best way of learning so teach 90% 95% writing and implementing 5 to 10% teach initially but afterwards teaching also increases as a time once your implementation power uh, increases you can teach more also okay wish you all the best friends wonderful i really uh, do you see if you write a diary do you see in your future that you will be with the whole 100% oneness all the time 100% love is called oneness 100% love with the whole is called oneness can you imagine a life full filled with the love yeah can you if you can connect to the life filled with the love you can say 100% love okay 100% 100% love you can type it 100 love okay 100% all 24 hours all these situations this but not only the 65 days your love is filled in a, such a connected connection a greater connection that you are even though not only this life but every day the love you are the becoming the love with everything like you know, you're the eternal love you become the eternal love that kind of 100% love you can if you can connect and see that type it if you can imagine if you can practice it then it will be an amazing gift to you you can say this is the day you can remember this is the day this is the 19th may 2022 is the day i changed my, the complete my life transform you can say after 5 years after 10 years after all your life long life long life long you can say this is, you can remember this day 19th may after buddha born my 3 days i got a blessing in my life that day changed my life all of my life a grand ma- I, a class with the grand master changed my entire life everybody ask what is your secret how you, how you can be this much loving everybody surprised and asked you in the, every time every then you can proudly say 19th may 2022 that's where my life changed and you can also change your life from today onwards i'm giving you this technique because first thing is you need to practice first two, two months you do not tell it to anyone first two months two months or three months or six months okay but first three persons will tell that hey three first you without telling anyone you practice for three two to three months usually within three months what happens is you are just practicing it sincerely within sometimes it's like it may be less than within few days on first week only people start telling you hey i am feeling more loving vibrations here from you you are you are loud you know people will say will talk to you you are lovely and i know i love you no automatically i am feeling the love from you people will communicate to you at least three people communicated to you that means that you passed but telling others okay at least three people if you 
if any already uh, some people are telling that you're loving you can type that so everyone is god simply see that and for example if a, if a person is beautiful we can love that person a small child is beautiful charming ha 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 he's laughing we can love that person automatically a beautiful child a smile and charm is there that's okay but when a ugly person is there also that means and we are not loving the face we are not loving the body i mean not only we, we can love uh, we can see the inside them so one person is good one person is bad doing all bad things is killing others his character is not good so still can we love him that is we can love the god inside them god is there inside everyone so we need to see them in ugly more ugliest person also god is there in a bad more most bad bad person also the god is there we need to see the positivity and we start loving everyone then the god is there everywhere every is there any place where the god is not there wherever the god is we can love everything everyone okay so okay friends wonderful so this is why you remember and if you practice and you remember the date and uh, if anybody already telling that uh, in your presence and we are feeling the love right? if you are that's uh, anybody you can type it also okay so you know at least three appreciations should come to you then now you start telling this to others okay very good friends wish you all the best for a complete love life complete blissful life love a lot of amazing love you you can become the ocean of love complete when you do near you everyone can feel that wow amazing love become the you become the love friends you can work work uh, for that like initially some work is needed afterward it should become uh, automatic automatic process very good the friends uh, next let us come back to come to the thoughtless training okay so now Shall we start meditation for twenty seconds? Ready? Want to start? Very good. Thank you. How many thoughts you got? Type it. What thoughts you got? Type it. now three things you remember i got a song venu mishra sang what song you got okay type what song and when is whatever clearly type your thoughts thought a song means i am saying the word the sentence if you are having a, this is you know this is the song i am getting you know, exactly in you know, bhasha okay that's okay you got a song you you know a humming is happening inside your mind mind is mind doesn't want to become it wants to bring some or the other things that's okay that's great now you recognize that your your mind is repeating a song you can stop the thought song and come back and observe the breath so normally repeating humming a song will give you health no? good vibrations if the song is positive good musical na 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 no any good things are happening that's okay but in meditation the greatness is in the silence dhyanam nirvishaya manaha okay cessation of thoughts is called meditation so so this is next level whole next level so here cut the if any song is there cut observe very good appreciate smile relax your body come back to breath so very good yeah somebody deepthi harsha mentioned this i want to do next call that next action ke uh, we are thinking about next action that's also part of the planning that's okay friends that's part of the meditation those are not that's not this uh, part of the meditation 
But remember, if, we, if you can do next actions, important things are there, you can think about it for one minute or two minutes. That's okay. Afterwards, immediately come back to it. Because uh, we are, you can, otherwise you can, so you can think that you can stop your meditation and uh, prepare your next actions, whatever, what you wanted to do in the next actions. Think and, that's, a, that's separate time. This is meditation is separate. Okay, you can spend one minute for that. After one minute, if any important things are there, if any reminder thoughts are there, next actions are there, that's, it's okay. Those are not disturbing. Those are important for your life, right? That's okay. So, Godavari Kanchu, she said, I saw two masters. If you're seeing anything, that's not a thought. That's called seeing. Thought is a repeat uh, a sentence. You're talking to yourself in a words or sentence or in your language. In a mother tongue. That's a thought. Okay, if you're seeing any master, that's okay. It's part of the advanced meditation. That's okay. But in the super advanced meditation, that also can be stopped. And that's called the good action next level. Next level course. But the, the super advanced meditation. How to stop the images, how to stop the, even the masters. Masters will give you all blessings and everything. That's okay. That's good. That's called advanced meditation. But you when you when you become the master, the super advanced meditation, the, the grand master, that also will not be their friends. So Ramakrishna Paramahansa, he uh, tells Sotapuri, his guru, Sotapuri is a grand master. Ramakrishna is a great master by the time already. Ramakrishna Paramahansa is a great master. He is doing advanced meditation. In meditation, he saw Devi, Devata, other goddess came and he told that mother goddess came to Sotapuri. Immediately, Sotapuri said, bring a sword and cut the goddess into two pieces. Then Ramakrishna Paramahansa, see, being a sincere devotee, he said, he said, okay, I'll cut it, but where, where, from where I should bring the sword? Ramakrishna Paramahansa asked, from where the Devi came, from there only bring the sword, he said. And he did like that. Buddha also says clearly, in your meditations, if I, if I come in your meditation, kill me, he says. <laughs> That's advanced, the super advanced meditation. But initially, that's okay, friends. Okay, coming, master's coming is very good, auspicious. It, it, it will improve your energies. Uh, it's for the until you become the great master. That's part of the meditation. Afterwards, I'm talking of the grand master. That's a, that's the next level. But uh, that's a, that's what grand master's coaching is. Gulakesha coaching, all night meditation, which is starting from June 24. I got a body ache after half an hour of meditation. It becomes tough to sit still. Yeah. So that's the reason I say do it small meditations. Okay. Do one minute meditation, 10 minutes meditation. After 10 minutes, walk for one, two minutes and come sit. How much are your body supposed to do that much only? Okay, friends. The thoughts are what are not thoughts? Positive things are not thoughts. Those are not. Do not count them as positive uh, thoughts. And any, any thoughts related to meditation, those are okay. Those are supportive thoughts. Okay, I'm observing, am I observing the breath or not? Let me observe my breath. And if you're having that thoughts, that's okay. Initially, I used to have that kind of thought. Okay, if I'm having any thought, no, cut the thought and come back and observe the breath. I used to say that in my mind, come back and observe the breath, observe the breath, observe the breath. And if, after a few days, just breath. After a few days, that also comes. Just the thought comes, I'll just cut and come back to the breath naturally without saying the words in my mind. That, that became natural. These are the supportive thoughts. This will dissolve automatically. Any thoughts related to meditation are okay, part of the meditation. Those will give strength to you for your meditation to become better. Those are okay. Okay. So, these are uh, so, and also any negative things are called thoughts. So, you know, clearly, see, also, car sound is coming. Okay, now outside there's some car, car somebody. Disturb the car. Some sound is coming. Oh, that is disturbing me. If you say that, that is your thought. The car sound is saying, but coming and you're not just commenting on that. You're just observing the car sound and everything. But in your mind, you're not saying a sentence out of it. That's Then you're not disturbed, getting disturbed. The meditation is proper. Okay, clear, friends? If you're clear, type C. Very good. Very good. So, next one is 
Next thing is homework time. Your homework is till one minute you are practicing the meditation. Next tomorrow's homework is every one minute you will get a bell sound. Ting, the bell sound comes. So every one minute you do meditation sincerely for one minute. After the bell comes again, you do meditation for only for one minute. You just feel that that's one minute only. Because your mind always can come, for, your mind is already practiced for one minute, it's okay. But for at least 10 minutes, you will be lost into some way. So that's the reason this is called divine and conquer, right? Here, every one minute we keep that bell sound, ting, the bell sound comes. Then immediately, again, only one minute you meditate, observe the breath and relax. So with that, you practice for 10 minutes. That's a tomorrow's homework. Okay. That video, YouTube video, we will provide it in your WhatsApp groups, relative WhatsApp groups. Practice with that WhatsApp group for 10 minutes uh, tomorrow by the evening, by the class, before you join the class, practice for two to three, three times. Okay. Then you'll get the mastery of the 10 minutes also. Okay. Wish you all the best friends. Thank you. The our class is officially over. Um, any announcements from some hosting team and from your email? I'll take it. Yeah, Simon. Yeah. No announcements as of now. Yeah. The music uh, video which you uh, shared, uh, the audio will be shared in the groups. Yeah. And uh, yeah, regarding Buddha Kesha, the flyer.